almost out, sir. Excellent. Darius. You just refuse to die, don't you? Tell me, why are you after the Dragonstone? Why does a team steal anything, Serial? I don't need a reason for what would I do.
Welcome back, Mr. Therion. I hope you didn't run into too much trouble. What of the Emerald Stone? I don't have it. It was stolen by another thief. Yet another thief? But I don't intend to let it get far. I'll get it back for sure. And is that for our sake? Of course not. It's to get this band off of me. And to tie up some loose ends. It has nothing to do with you two. Forgive me for asking, but are those loose ends the reason you look so sad from time to time? Like I said, it has nothing to do with you two. I don't need pity from a sheltered princess like you who's never known betrayal. And if I have? After my parents passed, I feared I would be all alone. But then, countless people came from far and wide to be at my side. I thought them all so kind and caring, filling the empty space my parents left behind. Or so I thought. In the end, all they wanted was money. They didn't care about me. Not at all. I felt the sting of betrayal from each and every single one of them. Hmm. I understand now why that look on your face haunted me so. It was so familiar, filled with the same pain that filled mine then. Hmm. The ones who stole the Emerald Dragonstone were brigands from Northridge. They're no small group either and are led by a man named Darius. They have dominion over the entire town and rule it with an iron fist. And it seems they are already in possession of the gold stone. I will make my way toward Northridge first. I will try to glean what information I can along the way. Please be careful out there, Heathcote. Of course. Please await my return, my lady. Understood. I... Is something the matter, Mr. Therion? After all you've been through, how can you still believe in other people? He could taught me something. Only the betrayed know the true meaning of trust. From the moment we met, Heathcote has never once betrayed me. And that's why I can still believe in others. I won't pretend to know anything about your past or by whom you were betrayed. But you believed in them, Percy, didn't you? You believed in them so much that when you were betrayed, you never wanted to feel that way ever again. I... You understand, don't you? It's believing in people that makes us strong. Mr. Perion, I have faith in you. Please be careful. 